Yeah, it's quite good, yeah. Um, I've been painting lots of things. I, I'm feeling better off the back of it, you know, now it's been done. Um, you know, it, it took a long time to do, you know, um, recording, writing, producing. Um, but it's been an experience, and it's maybe not an experience I want to repeat on the same scale. Um, and though it's been... Uh, Uh, probably the in excess, or in excess to who knows he who cares through in excess. Uh, Rory always writes shit, so uh, pretty much everything on Monet actually is brilliant. Musically, our albums have been quite successful, uh, as in. Uh, I've quite enjoyed listening to a couple of the songs occasionally, uh, whereas sometimes uh, our songs... I think people with no interest in music, they don't understand the intricacies and the qualities of our music, so, um, so they tend not to like it quite as much. Whereas people who understand music, uh, which isn't a very high percentage of the population unfortunately, uh, they all think our album's brilliant. Mixed reviews, I mean, people tend to like the music that I wrote, which is um, all the good songs, mainly. It's clever, it's like less, less commercial but more successful. As you'd expect, we've made some money, but we've spent our money as well, uh, quite wisely. Um, or I've spent our money quite wisely on things. The expenses, I, I don't know, I mean, it took a long time. I, I never really bothered to figure out the exact cost that it, it, it involved. Mm. Yeah, we're, we're, we've been doing some uh, acoustic uh, sessions again. Uh, starting work on, well, we're starting preliminary work, really, on uh, the follow-up to Open Money. Um, I'm really liking where it's going at the moment. It's, it's quite exciting. Um, I think musically it's it, musically it's different. It's perhaps uh, more more or less commercial than uh, Open Money. Glenn's an artwork brute, yeah. Uh, we're, we've uh, recorded Rhombic Dodecahedron, which has been a great success. Uh, we're part of the way through recording The Cube, but The Cube's had to take a bit of a break, um, you know, through uh, us being being distant from each other for a short while geographically, of course, not in our hearts. Our hearts were always with each other, uh, but geographically, there's been some distance. And uh, yeah, yeah, but you know, now the cube is back on track. And I I did do the uh, Open Monet cover mostly. I think <laughs> I don't remember. It was so long ago. Yeah, um, you know, artisticness has always been a, a great thing for me. I um, might go and spend some time in uh, in the Indian Ocean, finding myself. Um, I'm thinking about, you know, going away, growing my hair, growing a beard, becoming a Mongolian sheep herder maybe for a while. I mean, nothing's finalised yet. No, 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 it'll, it'll create a creative distraction. Um, I think it, it, it will be purely a, a short-term self-discovery so we can come back and, you know, improve, maybe refocus. Because, you know, the amount of effort that we've put into doing Hope and Money is it's taking a lot out of us and we need to refocus. And I think maybe spending some time in the Indian Ocean and going up to Mongolia and growing my hair and beard, you know, it could be highly beneficial for us. I'm keeping it under wraps, um, you know, because I don't want it to be a... You know, I'm waiting until I can have a big reveal. Yes. Sort of. But I went to his housewarming party the other week, it was uh, messy. Yeah, there's been no repercussions. It's 
No. I am a clean legal man. Absolute bullshit, I'm telling you. No one's done anything wrong. So. <laughs> Take that camera away! Rory will tell anyone anything um, if he thinks it can get him laid. So. I mean, it was, it was a lot simpler than he might think. You meant to. Yeah, which. You meant to. Yeah. No, Rory's got a magic mouth. But there's a what? Not his twat. Thank you.